He was just getting lessons on shooting that long ago. So NCU game kind of like a, a teaser game for fans because they've got to see you guys back out here on the court, but how excited is this team to finally have the opener? Well, I think they are excited. It, uh, it's been a long off season and uh, a lot of work this summer, this fall, so I think the guys are ready to go. Uh, it's the start of uh, hopefully a long five months that uh, the guys can enjoy. And, uh, a lot of games, uh, you know, a lot of travel, so uh, it's getting it started. Casey was saying that rebounding was a, a big emphasis for you guys coming out of that NCU game. Defensively, in general, how do you think that like, stands up? It's been a big emphasis for us, you know, the entire preseason here. They just haven't listened. Uh, you know, we, we hope to improve our rebounding. I think that's a big area for us, big area of concern. So. Uh, the guys are getting better at it. We had a better week this week. We finally you know, blocked somebody out. Uh, but it's uh, we've got to make it a habit, you know, and uh, you have to think about it every time. It's, it's really hard to do. It's just got to be second nature to you. And right now our habits just aren't very good uh, defensively and on the rebounding. Now offensively, everybody looking to be aggressive and wants to score, but uh, we need that same type of aggressiveness on the boards. and definitely on the defensive end. Is that normal for this early in the season or is it maybe different than previous years? You know, it varies from season to season. Uh, you know, I don't know if this season is too much different than any other year. I was just hoping with, you know, some of the increased size, you know, that we'd be a little bit more attentive to it and our guards with a little more experience would be a little bit, you know, more engaged in the rebounding and that. But, uh, uh, you know, you got to get those attention to detail, those emphasis, points of emphasis. Uh, every team's different. Was there talk over the last couple of days about just not getting lots of days ago when you build the lead after what happened there against NCU? I'm not sure. You know, I mean, um, we just we have so much uh, to work on in so many areas. Uh, we've had a lot of different conversations, you know, and, uh, and that's what those early games are for. You know, we, we learned a lot from the Oklahoma scrimmage. We learned a lot from the scrimmage the other night. So uh, hopefully our guys will be able to continue to make steps. We'll learn some Friday night about our team. And we'll learn a lot next week at Baylor and, and at home against Velpo. We, you know, we've got a big week coming up. Do you have to have any conversation about not looking at Baylor? Or are these guys pretty good about focusing on the next one? You know, I, uh, you know we've been talking about our early schedule. Uh, you know, and there's a danger in that when you talk about games in plural. But I, you know, I wanted them to get ready for a stretch here. Um, you know, when you're looking at Army, and then Tuesday, Thursday, and then we jump on a plane Friday, and then we play Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday of the next week. That's six games, really quick. And and so we've been talking about the group of six, uh, and, I, and I think you know they're experienced enough. They should be able to look at them one at a time, but. Uh, you know, Fridays are opener. They'll be they'll be focused in on Friday. That uh, is something I'm, I'm sure they'll be able to do. Important to start that stretch off with some confidence, though, in, at least in how you're playing. Oh, absolutely, yeah, absolutely. No, no. We you know we want to play well. There's there's no doubt about that. We need to play well, and uh, uh, so I, it will be an important game for us, no doubt. You talk about wanting to see some man defense. Were you able to mix and match as much as you might have liked the other night? And where do you feel like you're at in terms of having the full menu of what you want to do available? Well, we, we just we played all man the other night okay. and then and ran one possession of uh, a press, our, our softer press, and one possession of our harder press just to get it on film so we could talk about it on film. But, uh, no, that uh, was all we did. I, you know, I'm not sure how this season's going to break up with uh, man and zone, but, uh, you know, this time of year we're working on both. And there's a danger in that because you, you don't do anything well, so you know. You, oh, but we know for the season we're going to do both, and so we get that started right away. As you watched the film, then, what did you think of the effort on, in, in the man, and did you feel good the first, about what you The first half, I thought our effort was really good. Uh, it was right there in front of us, and the coaches were barking at him a little bit, and I thought our effort was pretty good in the second half. Uh, you know, it wasn't nearly as good, but uh, we're making progress. Uh, our new guys are, are making progress. Our old guys, they just got to get that intensity back and the communication back. At the end of the year last year, I thought defensively we were playing pretty well. And, um, you know, we, we just got to get back to those those types of standards. Have you gotten any letters of intent that you can talk about yet? Uh, you know, we haven't got them all back yet. 
paying enough attention on that stuff. Uh, uh, but I, we anticipate three, and uh, I think we have got a couple back. I, I think we'll just make an announcement tomorrow at the game, and we can talk about all three, and I don't break any rules. You know, so, uh, but we, I think I can say that we are anticipating three, and uh, uh, so hopefully everything will get done. We, you know, I will say that we're very excited. I can say that with, as long as I don't name any names. So uh, I, I really like the group and uh, really excited. Any more thoughts on the matchup tomorrow, how you guys match up? You know, they, they're quick. Uh, they really push the ball. They had a, a, a scrimmage against Cornell, and, and we did get the film on that. And I uh, like their aggressiveness. I like how they are well coached. They, uh, they're soldiers. I mean, they're, they're where they're supposed to be all the time. Uh, I tell you, it was it was impressive to watch them on film with a young group. Uh, just uh, the attention to detail and the fundamentals. Uh, we'll have our work cut out for us in that regard because they they really you know, get where they're supposed to get defensively. They're they're where they're supposed to be. Uh, they're a well coached team. Sounds like you might have a big crowd here tonight or tomorrow night. What importance of that for just? The season off and guys it, it would be nice, and, and it would be really nice for the veterans. You know, I, it's a military day for us. It's Veterans Day, uh, which obviously means a lot to, to all of us. And uh, so, uh, we're honoring them. Uh, with Army in town, it was kind of a natural tie-in. Uh, so, you know, I hope there's a good crowd. Our, our team seems to respond to that. Uh, we've got a little nice home winning streak going here, and uh, hopefully we'll be able to, to keep that going. But there are no guarantees. I tell our guys, uh, you know, don't think that it's going to take care of itself just because we're at home, and that's every night we play. Thanks, Dan. Thanks, All right.